Hi guys, welcome back to my channel, or welcome if you're new here. I am going to start a week in my life vlog. It is Monday morning right now, and I'm in my car about to grab some breakfast at this place called White Rhino in Uptown Dallas. This is gonna be my third time coming here. It's so good. I'm gonna show you guys what I get. Yeah, if you're in the Dallas area or if you're ever visiting Dallas, I highly recommend checking this place out. Also, mark my words, this is the last time I'm going to buy breakfast because today we're going grocery shopping. We haven't had groceries in like almost a month. We've just been ordering delivery. Shout out to Uber Eats but it's not good. We really need to start cooking at home more. We have a beautiful kitchen and we're just like not using that. So anyways, mark my words. This is the last time we're going to buy breakfast. Starting tomorrow, we are going to make our breakfast at home and it's gonna be great, it's gonna be delicious and it's gonna be affordable, so yeah. Anyways, let's go buy our breakfast. Hey, how are you doing today? Hi, good, how are you? Good, what can I get for you? Could I get an ice matcha latte? Absolutely. And then, uh, I forgot what it was called last time. It was like a bowl and it had sweet potatoes. The loaded sweet potato pack. Yes, can yeah. I get it to go? Absolutely. Okay, do you want that with regular milk or an alternative? Um, could I get almond milk? Alrighty, what's up? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so, Sloan Bird. Yeah, that's me. Thank you. No problem. See y'all. Okay guys, so I just got back from Trader Joe's and I thought I would give a little rundown of everything that I got. Now, disclaimer, we usually don't get this many groceries. The reason why this is so much this time is because like I said earlier, we haven't gone grocery shopping in about a month. So we literally have nothing in our pantry and fridge. So usually this is not how it is. We got some flowers. I like to get the white roses for the living room. And I have to get three like bunches of them because our base is so big that if I get anything less than three of them, they'll like fall through, like they won't fit in the vase. We got bananas, cucumbers, some pasta, mint leaves. I love to put them in my tea at night. I don't always drink tea at night, by the way, but when I do, I like to stick a couple of mint leaves in there. Lots of avocados, because I love avocado. Um, onion, mango, lots of red bell peppers, and a couple of orange bell peppers because some of the recipes that I plan on making for dinner this week call for red bell peppers. I think like three of the recipes do, so that's why we got so many. Lemon, lime. Aussie loves these salt and pepper potato chips from Trader Joe's, so got him a bag of that. Couple of things of salmon, baby spinach, arugula, 
I love cherry tomatoes. I eat them with my breakfast. Strawberries, we love strawberries. Some fresh basil. And then I got orange juice because I love Trader Joe's orange juice. I drink some every morning. And then I got two things of Trader Joe's lemonade because Aussie absolutely loves their lemonade. Oh, and then I got crumbled feta and then this dip that I'm gonna try. But yeah, that's basically it for this little grocery haul. I think I had mentioned this earlier in the video, but we go to Trader Joe's to get basically all of our produce and then like anything that's like specifically from Trader Joe's. But then we also go to Walmart to get like all of our other things. But I like to do curbside pickup for Walmart since that's an option and it's just so easy. Hopefully Aussie can do that because I have some stuff to do but I'm not sure what he's up to right now. So we have more groceries on the way. We have nothing. We have been fully dependent off of Uber Eats for the last like month, probably even over a month. It's been crazy. just getting some work done, um, going through emails, writing up some concepts for upcoming sponsorships. And I just wanted to show you guys my little work setup. So we have my emotional support water bottle. It's my favorite. It's a Hydro Flask. I think it's the 32 ounce. And then I got a candle yesterday from Bath and Body Works. It's Fiji White Sands and it smells so fresh and yummy and perfect for spring. And then we have the fresh flower set up, of course. I have my phone and my laptop. Yeah, just getting some work done. Nothing too crazy or special. This is a typical Monday in my life, just trying to do some planning and respond to a ton of emails. Emails tend to roll in at around 10.30 in the morning and right now it's almost two. So I'm a little behind and I consider myself running behind right now because I like to respond to emails right away. Like I just like being on top of it. I don't like making people wait. I don't like when people make me wait. Yeah, I'm trying to just like hurry up and like at least respond to all of the emails and you know, get everything that I need to get done, done later on, hopefully before the end of the day. I don't know. It's really hard like with jobs like this where you're kind of like your own boss and you're working from home and it's kind of hard to like put a limit on when you should start and stop working. But I try to like give myself, you know, like a window of time every day to get everything done. And I would say like 8 p.m is like the latest that I will like send an email or like submit content. That's what I'm doing right now. I might film a video at some point. I might do my makeup today, but I'm not really sure. I'm trying to let my skin breathe a little bit because I'm trying to like let my skin finish purging. My forehead is breaking out. This is not like an actual pimple. It's like healing, it's like flat, but my chin is breaking out. I'm trying not to like put a ton of stuff on my skin. I'm trying to just let it breathe right now, so. But yeah, anyways, that is what I'm up to right now. Also, I forgot to mention that part of my work day is going through DMs on my Instagram page, especially like in my message requests. I always get brands reaching out, people asking questions, wanting me to like link items on my story so that is a huge part of my work day and i'm covering it with my hand because i don't want to like show any names or anything like that or messages so yeah i don't know i thought that was like important to mention hi guys it is currently 5 25 and this is what we're working with i'm in bed i'm still working by the way i think the last time we talked it was like two o'clock i've moved to my bed per usual which is dangerous, by the way, because I can easily just like lay my head down and take a nap. 
but I'm trying to keep myself awake to finish my work. I'm also sipping on a Sprite Zero. Very unusual for me. So what had happened was Aussie ended up picking up our Walmart groceries and Walmart curbside pickup is so weird. I don't know what kind of system they use to like get our groceries and stuff like that, but it's so weird. We didn't even ask for this. I've never had a Sprite Zero. And they also got us dryer sheets from a brand that we don't use. It's so weird. But anyways, I was like, okay, why not? I'm gonna try this. And it's pretty good, not gonna lie. But anyways, yeah, I'm just sitting in bed, finishing up work. I'm gonna try to be done by like eight. That's my limit, 8 p.m. Right now, I'm just shopping for a dress on my phone. I need a dress for an upcoming partnership. I like to have my content like really high quality for these partnerships. This one specifically is for like a designer brand. So I like really want it like, perfect and amazing and just everything looking great. So usually I will purchase newer wardrobe pieces. But right now I'm on Rent the Runway, one of my favorite places to get pieces for situations like this just because I can rent it and for sure return it. And I've been emailing back and forth with my agent about um, current and new sponsorships. I got one new sponsorship, which is what I'm shopping for an outfit for. And then I have like another like possible one that I got today. Everything else that I've been doing is just like um, writing up concepts and getting all of the preparation out of the way for like other partnerships that have been going on. It's so stressful and everything's so last minute, but like we love it. We're having a blast. I'm so blessed to call this my job. Like I'm literally shopping in my bed right now and that's like work. This is my work day. Sipping on a Sprite Zero. <sighs> yes. Anyways, Aussie's cooking dinner tonight, which I'm very excited about. Hopefully he kills it, because sometimes, not gonna lie, he butchers some of our meals. But anyways, I think he's gonna kill it tonight, because he's made this a couple of times. So yeah, I'm gonna finish up my work, and I'll see you guys once it's time to eat some dinner. Okay, dinner is served, finally. What'd you make us? Well, I was on dinner tonight, so I picked one of my favorites here in the Bird Foster residence. I got this recipe from Real M on TikTok, and it is a honey glazed salmon with rice and salsa on the side. The green sauce that you see on top is actually avocado sauce, which just enhances the flavor, makes it more rich. Probably my favorite thing to make. Yum. And the avocado sauce kind of looks funny because of the uh, like consistency, wouldn't you say? Yeah, it's a lot better than it looks. If I had something else to put it on the plate with, something that was maybe a little more thin, it'd look better. Yeah. But it's not about how it looks. It's as about much how it about tastes. how it tastes. Yep. So. It's all about how it tastes. And it tastes pretty good. morning guys it is tuesday i don't know if you can hear aussie's alarm going off in the background but i am up and at him this morning i'm about to go to a hot pilates class and i'm just eating some breakfast right now i needed to make something quick because i'm kind of running late so i made myself a little thing of orange juice and bagel also just in case you were wondering what i'm wearing i have this little purple set from Set Active, and then my knockoff Uggs from Target, and this little zip-up jacket, just because I'm not sure if it's cold outside or not. So I'm gonna eat some breakfast really quick, and then we're gonna head on over to class.
Oh my god. So I just got done with my hot Pilates class. There's a smoothie place right across from my hot Pilates studio. And they're called Clean Juice. And I just saw the owner walking out of class. And she was like, hey, do you want a shot? And I was like, sure. So I guess we can take this right now. Why not? It's the Immune Booster. And it has organic ginger, organic lemon, and organic carrot. Yum. It's like thick. So I don't know. Woo. Okay. Okay. We're just going to do it. Ah! I'm scared. Oh! It burns! We did it. Period! I'm gonna head home, shower, probably do my hair and makeup because I have some videos that I want to film. By the way, y'all are gonna think I'm so gross. I still have my breakfast in here from yesterday. When I went grocery shopping, I grabbed all of the bags and my hands were so full that I didn't grab my breakfast. So it's been sitting in here all night. So I need to make sure I grab that whenever I get back home. <laughs> my music just started playing. <laughs> That's my pre hot Pilates hype song. So I wanted to talk a little bit about where I take Pilates at. I go to Shine Hot Pilates. If you're in the Dallas area, it's in the hill is what this little like area is called in Dallas. And you guys have to come and take a class with me and try it out. You can use my code join Sloan, J O I N S L O A N to try your first class for free. It can't get any better than that, honestly. It's so much fun. I took class um, from Becca today. I think I'm gonna go again on Thursday to take class from Rachel. I'm working on a couple of other things with them as well, which I'm really excited about. So I'm gonna head home now, take a shower, and keep doing some work. <laughs> Okay, so I just did my hair and makeup. I'm gonna film a couple of TikToks. Well, actually probably not a couple, probably just one. Aussie's right behind me and I'm waiting on him to finish making me something to eat. He's just making some leftovers, but we had to go get more salmon today and then we have to like remake the rice. That is what's up. Searching for something sweet that's cool in the summer to take away the sea. Nah, vanilla cold, she must do that. Okay, checking on the salmon. Wow. Oh my god, that looks so good. <laughs> This is a huge plate of it. I'm so, so hungry. All I had this morning was that bagel. But while I eat, I'm gonna be answering some DMs, emails, texts, and everything in between. If you guys follow me on TikTok or Instagram and you've been seeing my stories on there, you probably know that I've been looking for an assistant and a video editor. So that's kind of what I'm answering emails and text messages to because I've been getting a lot of inquiries about those two roles. So that's what I'm gonna be responding to and chatting with a few people just to see like what they're interested in doing for me and all that good stuff. Aussie knows the way to my heart. He made me my favorite meal ever. I think I said that about last night's dinner slash today's lunch. 
but this is actually my favorite meal ever. It's another recipe from Bria Lem. It's avocado pesto pasta. It's on my TikTok page. It's on my Instagram page. I also have the recipe on my highlights on my uh, Instagram profile. It is so, so good. I just added some red pepper flakes. Yeah, that's what's for dinner tonight. Hi guys, I am at the Thompson Hotel in Dallas. It's downtown Dallas for a little spa day. They wanna treat me to a facial and a blowout, which I love both of those. So this is gonna be the perfect start to my busy day. Apparently I'm gonna be here from 10 to two. And right now it's 9.48, ooh, 9.49 actually. So yeah, let's get our spa day started. This is gorgeous. Super exciting. Okay, so update. I'm also now having lunch here after my spa day. Best day ever. But it's 10.30. I thought my facial started at 10. It starts at 12. 30 y'all but i'm not mad that i'm stuck here i think i'm gonna like sit in like the infrared thing i might even take a shower i don't know i look really rough but i just got done with my facial and it was amazing and now i'm waiting to get started on my blowout And then I can head over Just tonight. Yeah, Nina's the hostess. She'll take care of you. First. Okay, awesome. Okay, thank thank you. you. Okay, so that is it for my spa day today. That was the most amazing experience ever that made my entire day hey guys so i just got home and i have some packages to open this is a mixture of pr packages and things that i've ordered so first thing is this package from reformation it's called the Zane two-piece and I got it in a size small and it's just a really pretty blue color. Next, we have a package from Skims and this is PR. Skims wanted to send me some product just for fun. Just, you know, super casual Skims, Miss Kim K. Whatever they got me, I'm probably gonna love it. I have this tank top from skims in the color bone but i don't have the shorts is this bone yep oh my gosh so now i have a matching little set <gasps> cute wait this is like this is great let's see what this is i'm pretty sure this is a bra that would make sense oh my god it is it's like a little cute bralette <gasps> i needed more like bralettes that i can wear like every day 
<laughs> Thank you, Skims. Wow. Oh my gosh. This is a package from Amazon. It's nothing important. It's something that's also for a partnership video. I think this is some lingerie that I bought. Yes, it is. It's from the brand Pepper. I have an upcoming photo shoot and one of the looks that I need to um, style myself with is lingerie. It's like a navy set, another blue set. Oh shoot, I can't show you guys this. This is for a partnership, but this is really exciting. Very exciting partnership. Yeah, hope you guys enjoyed that little scene. Wanted to show you guys the makeup look in better lighting. The lip combo that I have on right now is something that I've never tried before. This MAC lip pencil in the shade Cork. And then over that, I have this Patrick Ta lipstick in the shade She's Secure. And then on top of that, I put this lip maximizer from Dior on and it's in the shade 29. Hello? Do you want something from Chick-fil-A? Oh. <laughs> Hurry, I'm the next one in line. Oh, mind if I do? I'll have my use. Could I get an eight-piece nugget meal with a lemonade light ice? Anything else? A 12-piece nugget meal with a lemonade and Chick-fil-A sauce. today so one 30 minute session is equivalent to doing 20,000 crunches how do you feel Aussie are you nervous I'm nervous is it painful I've never done that no it's crunches. not painful at all so it's just going to be more intense so think of it as like doing a crunch but like holding it ah. and then you're activating 90 to 100 percent of that muscle She can't even say anything. I know. <laughs> it's like shaking my legs. Yeah. Alright, ready? Yeah, I'm ready. Ooh! <laughs> Looking her. Okay guys, so we just got back from Bio Med Spa in Richardson. How was that? Awesome. 10 out of 10 men recommend it. Mm, yes. It's so rare that like you see a man taking care of his skin and getting a facial done. Very, very rare. Very important, fellas. Yes. Anyways, when we were about to leave, they were like, hey, do you guys want to try some M Sculpt treatment? And I was like, what? So the way it felt for me is, if you can imagine, your muscles are just being forced to contract in your abs. Yes. But it won't let them relax. So yes. they just stay tight and that's your workout. It's like the, <laughs> it's like the rest of your body is relaxed because you're just laying there. We're gonna go again next week, and I'm gonna have like my shit together this time next week, so I can do like a full video about it and like my experience, and we'll take like before and after photos. But anyways, we're pulling up to dinner right now. Did I get the salmon bowl with rice and uh, the sweet potatoes with a fountain drink? Oh, same thing. Hi guys, um, it's been a while. I think the last time I saw you 
was when we were at dinner at Flower Child. I am all showered and ready for bed. We put fresh sheets on. I think I'm gonna end this vlog off here and say goodnight to everyone. And I just wanna thank you guys for watching this video and I hope you enjoyed and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.